Santa Claus, here comes Santa Claus, right down Santa Claus Lane. Hello, my name is Kendra. Welcome back to This Cozy Space. Today, I am going to share what I'm putting in my husband's stocking. If you saw my last video about the love of my life, my husband, uh, I talked a little bit about how hard he is to buy for. I'll link that down below. I shared the things that I picked up for him for Christmas this year. You might wanna go give it a peek if you haven't already. But all of that stuff that I said about, about him in that previous video, it all still is relevant for this video too. So not only is he hard to buy gifts for, but he's hard to fill a stocking for as well. But I think, I think this year, some years, it's like a roller coaster. Some years I've got great ideas, others I'm like, oh. And then the next year will be a great year. We're on a roll this year. So I have a stocking right here. He and I have matching stockings and my boys and our dogs have matching stockings. I love this stocking. This was from Target forever ago. I just think it's so cute with its felt detail on there and the stitching. So I have everything tucked inside. We're gonna unwrap and do a little chat, All right? Okay, so this brand was having a sale on Amazon. It's O'Keefe's. So I picked up several items from them. This is a hand cream and guys, it says right here, guaranteed a relief. So I've never tried it before, but it was on sale, had really good reviews and I thought, why not? This came with a two pack and I am also putting together a stocking for another male figure in my life. He will also be getting a hand cream in his stocking. We are in the desert now, y'all, and it is dry. And I can only imagine that the winter is going to be even more dry than it already is. And our skin is like this. So I think we need something to prepare for the winter. So I got him this. What else are, it's like, it's a surprise. Did you guys ever have a puppy surprise? Does anybody remember that? How many puppies are there inside? Puppy surprise, did you have one? I loved my puppy surprise. Okay, up next. This is not that exciting, but it's a great shape for a stocking. It's a food thermometer. My husband loves to cook and he's just really hard on some of his stuff and just kind of leaves it outside a lot. Like if it's something he uses in a grill or for the smoker, it stays outside unless I happen to catch it and bring it in. And sometimes the elements can get to it before I notice that it's there. So I didn't want to invest in anything because he's he goes through these like crazy. It, it, there's no like bells or whistles. It's just a very generic but handy food thermometer from Amazon. It was on sale. I think they had multiple colors in this as well. Not that I can show you the color that I picked. I don't even remember the color that I picked, but if you're looking for a particular color, I guess. Okay, this one I was pretty excited about. I purchased multiple containers of this. If I know you and you're an adult, you're getting this in your stocking this year and you're not gonna complain about it, right? Hopefully if you're an adult and I know you're not watching this because you might ruin some of your own surprises. Okay, this is Universal Dust Cleaning Gel. It looks like a container of hair gel or putty. It is actually putty. So you take this and it's like this ooey gooey stuff and you, press it into the surfaces of your car that have buttons like your console or little nooks and crannies that you can't get into to get crumbs out of and it like my skin in the desert it does that but like it sucks up all the things in this and supposedly you can reuse it over and over and over again i think it's just like one of those gifts that maybe you wouldn't pick up for yourself but if somebody gave it to you you'd be like oh wow that is really cool and look at the graphics it shows them that they're flattening it out on a keyboard and then this one has a hand just, <laughs> just pulling it up from the keyboard and it's got like little dust particles in it. So they did a gr great job with those graphics there. I mean, that just really hits it home. This was on sale on Amazon as well. So again, I picked up all the containers of that. This one's kind of boring, but my husband loves practicality in his gifts. One time I gave him an iron for Christmas when we were dating and he talked about that iron for years. He thought it was the best gift ever. That just goes to show you what kind of gift receiver he is. Um, this is a car squeegee. Who doesn't need a car squeegee, right? It's just like the one that you use at the gas station. That's what I saw when I opened this. I was like, oh, gas station car squeegee. I couldn't tell when I ordered it as well, uh, but it was on sale. Wow, all of the rhyming. I couldn't tell when I ordered it as well, but it was on sale. 
Oh my, Dr. Seuss up in here or something? Jeez. Uh, so it has the squeegee part on one side and the squishy sponge on the other. Um, it, everything here is dust. Oh my gosh, the amount of times I have to dust this house and sweep up red dust from our floor, dirt from our floors. And our cars are covered in it. We are often out on back little roads in the country and just kicking up all the dirt in the air and our car gets coated with it. So Kent has started to wash our cars himself and um, he gets the boys involved. It's kind of fun for all of them. And they do a great job. Let me tell you, I really wanted to get him like a whole car cleaning kit, but I felt kind of bad to do it because really he cleans my car the most. And I'm like, here's a gift so you can clean my car. I felt bad doing it. So I didn't do it, but that's an idea for you if you don't feel bad to give somebody that. Maybe like a teenager or something that cleans their own car with those things, then yes. Uh, but he really uses it just for my car. But I thought this would be something that he could use on his car and my car. And he's all, <laughs> he's always talking about how he's trying to keep the front window really clean for vlogging so that I can share things with you guys. I mean, if that's not a great Instagram slash YouTube husband, then I don't know what it is, and this will be a tool that helps him achieve ultimate window cleanliness. Um, what else do we have? Oh, I have to reach, part of my reach. Oh, okay, these were another Amazon special. They are shower steamer pods. I made that up, tablets. They're called tablets, shower steamer tablets. Let me tell you. Oh my gosh, these smell amazing. So I went for the one that's called Relief that just has like an, a eucalyptus, look it even says eucalyptus and mint. And this one is the Calm which has lavender and lavender. They smell wonderful. I bought him shower tablets in the past. I think I picked them up maybe even from Lush and he really liked them. He's not a bath guy. So this is kind of like a little pampery treat, especially with like sinus stuff or whatever. There's so many in each bag. Let me see if it tells you how many you get per bag. Um, I don't know. It doesn't tell me, but like the bag is chock full. They're like all in here and they're individually wrapped, I believe. So let's open, let's open a bag. We're going to do it. We're going to open a bag and I'm going to make sure they're individually wrapped because I feel like you need to know that. <gasps> Good news guys. They are individually wrapped. So my plan with these is to share the love. I'm going to put some in my boys' stuff. My boys know that my husband and I fill each other's stockings. Like Santa doesn't bring us stuff because we're adults, womp womp. So they know that we do that on our own. Um, but I'm gonna put some in my boys' stockings. And then also I mentioned that I'm filling a stocking for another adult figure in my life, a male figure. I'm gonna put some of these in his stocking and also in other people's. Like I've just got all the stockings. I'm putting it, everybody's getting some. I, sh I should even put some in my own stocking. I keep seeing these pop up on sale and I'm very tempted to purchase more bags because I know we'll use them. Funny side story. If you don't like tangents or side stories, I'm so sorry. I am that person, but I had a sick kid in the shower the other day and I have eucalyptus oil, like essential oils. And I, I do this to it in the shower and let it like drip down the shower walls. And so my, my son's in the shower. He's kind of like away from the shower wall. I try to have them step back. And I'm, I'm dosing the, the shower wall with little drops of eucalyptus and it is falling down and it is smelling delicious. And it's going to fill in my, my child's lungs and open his lungs and his sinuses. And I accidentally, get a drop right in his eyeball. Oh my gosh, can you imagine the pain to have eucalyptus in your eyeball burning? Oh, I felt so bad for him. Here I am trying to help him. He already feels bad and I'm like, Pew! right in your eye, friend. He got over it, but he did cry for a long time. I felt really bad. Okay, there's one last thing and I don't know why, but it's like over here across the room. So I'm gonna grab it real quick and I'll be right back. Hello. Ah, I'm back. I wish it was something that was like super exciting that warranted my, my jaunt across the room, but it's not that exciting, but it's fun. Okay, remember when I told you this company, did I tell you they had a sell? They had a sell. So I kind of bought a lot of stuff. I got some things for my boy stockings because Santa, shh. Um, like some chaps, I'll do a separate video. Let's not do that. I'll do a video of 
what Santa is putting in my boy's stockings for Christmas. But it's O'Keefe's um, Healthy Feet Foot Cream. We're not gonna we're not gonna call anybody out. We're not gonna put anybody on blast. But somebody in my life really needs this, and they would never put it on themselves. So it's like a two for gift because I will put it on for him so he gets a little foot rub with some cream. So that is my husband's stocking as of now. I might pick up like a couple little treats, little candy treats. He's not a big candy person, but oh, I always put beef jerky in his stocking. That's something I have to pick up. So I usually do beef jerky and maybe some type of a nut that he really likes, um, like snacky things. So I'll just go to Target and kind of walk and see what I find. And that'll be, that'll be great. Anyways, I hope you found something here that was inspiring in some way or that you could purchase for a loved one in your life. Maybe somebody that's hard to buy for like my husband if you have any awesome stocking stuffer ideas for the hard to buy for people in your life please leave them in a comment below so that we can help everybody pull together and shop for those hard people uh, I will see you in the next video please click subscribe if you haven't already done it I'd love to have you hang out with us here on the channel and I will see you in the next video goodbye everybody